Page 9, Exercise 4. Conversation. Describing work. Part A. Listen and practice. Where do you work, Andrea? I work for Thomas Cook Travel. Oh, really? What do you do there? I'm a guide. I take people on tours to countries in South America, like Peru. That sounds interesting. Yes, it's a great job. I love it. And what do you do? I'm a student. And I have a part-time job, too. Oh? Where do you work? In a fast-food restaurant. Which restaurant? Hamburger Heaven. Page 9, Exercise 4, Part B. Listen to the rest of the conversation. 1. What does Jason do exactly? 2. How does he like his job? What do you do exactly? Do you make hamburgers? No, I don't. I just take orders. And what's it like there? Do you like your job? Sure. It's fun. And I get free hamburgers, too. 10. Exercise 5. Grammar Focus. Simple present WH questions and statements. What do you do? I'm a student, and I have a part-time job. Where do you work? I work at a restaurant. I work in a restaurant. Where do you go to school? I go to the University of Texas. How do you like your school? I like it very much. Where does Andrea work? She works for Thomas Cook Travel. What does she do? She's a guide. She takes people on tours. Where does Jason go to school? He goes to New York University. How does he like it? He loves it. I, you. Work. Take. Study. Teach. Do. Go. Have. He, she. Works. Takes. Studies. Teaches. Does. Goes. Has. Page 11, Exercise 7, Conversation, Daily Schedules, Part A, Listen and Practice. How do you spend your day, Helen? Well, on weekdays I get up around 10, then I read the paper for an hour and have lunch at about noon. Really? What time do you go to work? I start work at 3. And when do you get home at night? I get home pretty late, around midnight. So, what do you do exactly? I'm a TV announcer. Don't you recognize me? I do the weather report on KNTV. Gee, I'm sorry. I don't watch TV. Page 11, Exercise 7, Part B. Listen to Daniel describe how he spends his day. One. What time does he get up? Start work. Study until. 2. What does he do? And you, Daniel, what's your day like? Well, right now I'm in school, so I just have a part-time job. But I'm pretty busy. I get up early, around 6 a.m. Then I work from 7 until 9. I go to school and study until 4 p.m. Then I work again from 5 until 7. So what do you do? 
<laughs> I'm a dog walker. A what? What's that? A dog walker. I take people's dogs for walks. It's great, and it keeps me in shape too. Page eleven, exercise eight, pronunciation, unstressed words, part A, listen and practice. The prepositions in these sentences, around, for, and at, are not stressed. I get up around ten. I read the paper for an hour. I have lunch at about noon. Page twelve, exercise nine, grammar focus, time expressions. I get up at seven in the morning on weekdays. I go to bed around ten in the evening on weeknights. I leave work early in the afternoon on weekends. I get home late at night on Fridays. I stay up until midnight on Saturdays. I wake up before noon on Sundays. I wake up after noon on Sundays. Ways to express clock time. Seven. Seven o'clock. Seven. Seven in the morning equals seven a.m. Seven in the evening equals seven p.m. Page 12, Exercise 10, Listening, Part A. Listen to Rodney, Tina, and Ellen talk about their daily schedules. Complete the chart. What do you do, Rodney? I'm a chef. Hey, that's great. So, what are your work hours like? They're okay. I work in the afternoons and evenings. I get up around 9 a.m. and I work from 11 a.m. until 10 p.m. I get home fairly late, about 11 p.m., and I'm usually in bed by 1 in the morning. And what do you do, Tina? Well, I'm an office manager. It's a regular 9-to-5 office job, so I get up at 7 a.m. and get home around 6 p.m. That's okay, though, because I like to go out at night. I go to bed around midnight on weekdays. What about you, Ellen? Well, my job is a bit different. I'm a flight attendant. I start work at 6 in the morning, so I have to get up before 5 a.m. Wow, that's too early for me. Then I often have long flights, so I don't get home until 9 o'clock at night, but I always go straight to bed around 10.